Once upon a time in a small village nestled between rolling hills and babbling brooks, there lived a young woman named May. May was known for her kindness and gentle spirit, but she often found herself overwhelmed by the chaos of daily life. One day, feeling the weight of her responsibilities and the constant chatter of her mind, May decided it was time to embark on a journey to train her restless brain. She sought the guidance of an old sage named Master Wu, who was renowned for his wisdom and understanding of the human mind. Master Wu lived atop a tranquil mountain, and May climbed the winding path to reach him. When she finally stood before the wise old sage, she asked, Master Wu, how can I train my brain to find peace and clarity in this bustling world? Master Wu smiled, his eyes twinkling with ancient knowledge. He beckoned Mei to sit beside him and began to share a tale. Imagine, he began, that your mind is like a wild horse, untamed and full of energy. To train this horse, you must first understand its nature. Just as a horse needs a patient and skilled rider, your mind requires a gentle and disciplined guide. Master Wu went on to explain that the key to training the mind was to observe its tendencies without judgment. Mei listened intently as he spoke of the importance of mindfulness, being present in each moment without dwelling on the past or worrying about the future. To begin, Master Wu advised, find a quiet space where you can sit comfortably. Close your eyes and simply pay attention to your breath. Feel the air entering and leaving your body. As thoughts arise, acknowledge them without attachment, like clouds passing through the vast sky. Mei followed Master Wu's guidance and started her daily practice. In the beginning, her mind was like the untamed horse, galloping in all directions. But with time and patience, she noticed a subtle change. The wild gallops became gentle trots, and the chaotic thoughts began to settle like dust in a still pond. Master Wu continued to mentor Mei, teaching her the art of letting go. He told her, just as a river flows freely, let your thoughts come and go without resistance. Do not cling to them, for in the river of your mind, they are mere ripples. As the seasons passed, May's mind transformed. She discovered a newfound sense of calm and clarity. Life's challenges no longer overwhelmed her, and she approached each moment with a serene presence. One day, Master Wu asked May, what have you learned on this journey of training your mind? May smiled, gratitude shining in her eyes. I have learned that the true strength lies in the stillness within. By training my mind, I've tamed the wild horse, and now I ride through life with grace and tranquility. And so, May returned to her village, carrying the wisdom she gained from the mountaintop. She shared her story with others, inspiring them to embark on their own journeys of training the mind. In the small village, the ripple effect began, and the once bustling community learned the art of finding peace in the midst of chaos. And thus, the tale of May and Master Wu became a timeless reminder that, with patience and mindfulness, one can train the restless mind to find serenity in the dance of life.